Well, David obviously has a terrific sense of style. It's just that he is lacking in interpersonal skills, you know, communication skills, customer service skills. Let's say that I'm not here and you need to answer the phone. Well, this is embarrassing. Just answer the phone. Bring, okay. bring, 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 bring. Hi. Why don't we just give it another try? Just start with, um, hello, this is the blouse bar. Bring, 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 bring. Hi, how are you? David, no. Blouse barn. Blouse barn. Hello, this is the blouse barn. Can I help you? Well, don't you think if they're calling the blouse barn, they know they're calling the blouse barn? Like, why do I have to say blouse barn? Let's try it again with a little more information. Oh, bring, 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 bring. Hello, this is the blouse barn, obviously. How can I make your day better? Now, let's say a woman my age mm -hmm. is looking for a top mm -hmm. and she's looking and she sees this top. Mm -hmm. What are you going to say to her? I would say I think there are other options. This one's a little bit skanky. You do not say skanky. Trashy. None of these words will work in the blouse barn. What you might say is, ooh, it's very central pet or it would be lovely for going out and shopping for makeup. I don't even know what fabric. This is made out of just human yes. hair or something. Acrylic, Italian acrylic, David.